Next, and a mother whose son was left severely brain damaged after falling off a scrambler bike is backing a crackdown on illegal bikes over the summer. The six-week operation on Merseyside will target hotspots for riders involved in the illegal or anti-social use of scramblers. Our correspondent Elaine Wilcox has been speaking to Nikki Woods. It breaks my heart every day. Just 30 seconds on the back of a scrambler bike destroyed Liam Clark's life. He was 15 when he suffered severe brain damage and a broken back, falling off a bike near his home in St Helens. I hope that it will prevent what happened to Liam, happening to any other 15-year-old boy. And I hope adults who know only put kids on bikes see sense and realise that this is what could happen. Liam's mother is backing a six-week campaign by Merseyside Police, warning of the dangers of scramblers and quad bikes. This footage, apparently filmed in Croxteth, has been posted online with riders without helmets doing wheelies in traffic, oblivious to the dangers. Officers are now targeting hotspots where illegal or antisocial bikers are known to ride. We want to try as best we can to ensure we don't have another repeat incident like that's similar to uh, Liam, you know, where we see the tragic impact on him and his family. And uh, ultimately, we're going to try and get as many of these bikes off the street as we can. Doctors treating Liam say there have been three deaths involving scrambler bikes in the past year on Merseyside, with many more injured. In this sort of activity, messing around what seems to be harmless fun can, in a split second, turn to a devastating lifelong injury or death that in the case of an injury will affect your life forever. Liam had been playing in fields near his home when he got on the back of a scrambler bike and fell. His mother said his life ended that moment. Had I provided the motorbike that Liam was on that day I would never ever have forgave myself for what happened and other parents have to think about the consequences. Merseyside police are warning in the wrong hands these bikes can be lethal. Any illegal bikes will be seized and crushed. Elaine Wilcox, ITV News, Liverpool. More news now. A man has been charged